And here we have a short video to demonstrate my Hornby 00 modified Bobo. And here we have 24 wagons going up this incline. And there we have the Bobo right there. Now this is being operated from a feedback controller so I'm able to get really slow speeds even under load it'll go less than less than walking speed that one And I'll just whip the body off one second so we can see inside some of the modifications I've made. Um, there's a little lead weight on the front. This uh, helps with the electrical pickup because uh, I now have uh, four. Let's see if I can take it off there. I can have. There's four tyres now on there. I put the extra tyres on. To give me more traction. Uh, there's a little bit of uh, extra weight in the way of lead at the back. The magnet is original, uh, I don't think you can really see it too well there. And the motor has been rewound with a few extra turns to, to give it uh, a little bit more power. Um, also underneath there's a, a little little spring clip that also helps, helps with the electrical pickup. I'm just going to turn this around and do a, a little demonstration here to show why I always put my diesels with the uh, with the motor uh, with the motor bogey uh, pulling. Let's have a look if we can wait okay if you if you look at the wheel, just at uh, the wheels here, when it starts to pick up a load, you see, you can see right there how it crabs up. Now that will cause a derail derailment. So that's the whole reason for for doing it the way I do do it. Let's turn it back. You see, if the load is on this side here, it just it pulls the wheel off, or the other way pushes it up. That way, pulls it off as well. With the load on the back, it has a lot better chance of staying on. Uh, that one couple so easy. Let's uh, just there. You can see. Uh, handles this load very well. Remember, this is 24 coaches going up and uh, 24 wagons going up an incline. Control it as I like. Continuous road run on my pump yard here. 